Hey guys, it's me yes, and welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you the easiest way how to make this type of yeah, social media poster and those are pretty much easy and I'll show you easiest way how to make this one and uh, effectively. So let's start the tutorial. Here I'll go to the file and taking new options. From here I'll take an artboard which is the square shape. Any sort of square shape you can take. I'm taking here 2000 and 2000 pixel and SMP text tag. So text. Okay. And hit the create button. That's fine. I'm using another tool which is the illustrator for my uh, like convenient or like easiest way to make the shape in this file and uh, and paste in a photoshop which is really easy so at first i'm going to the photoshop over there and going to the file and place embedded options from here i'll import a paper texture like this i'll provide you the download link in my video description and like that so it would be like that and when i'll multiply or blend this one it will make you literally amazing and like uh, which is the trendy way okay after that a shape over there so going to the illustrator and going to the rectangle tool which is pretty much easy just make a square shape by pressing shift and hold it and then press the shift and hold and select the corner i want to make this one corner round and copying this one and paste over there control or command v you can make the smart object if you make this one a smart object you can edit in future you can keep it pixel which is not uh, the smart object which is the raster one so you can select one of them i'm selecting here the pixels and hit ok making this one smaller like this and after that going to the place embedded options the stock photo i'll import over there making this one is smaller right press crystal as the layer and then right press and create clipping mask before that you can make this one convert to a smart object in future you can edit this one according to this okay Create clipping mask. Press Ctrl or Command T. Resize the photo according to this. That's good. And now, right press and re going to the adjustment layer. Going to the solid color and select color from here and hit OK. Right press. Actually, in a blend mode, I'll make this one multiply. Okay, another shape going to over there. In a illustrator, right press actually over there. Just make this one stroke mode and make this one into white color. So, selecting color from here, double press over there, make this one white and hit OK. That's great. And controller command C that means copy, controller command V that means paste. Okay, I'll make this one smaller like this, a little bit up like that that's fine now another shape making process going to the illustrator again and then going to the ellipse tool make this one more zoom draw this like a small circle over there press alter option button on copy this one and control or command d it will make the shape like that that means the repetition press alter option button and drag this one and press control or command d that's good. Copying this shape and pasting over there. So small pull cutters will get over there. So press Ctrl Command T. Make this one upper side of the layer. Upper side of the layer. Press Ctrl Command T. Or place over there and place over there. That's good. That is making the another dimension. And logo over there. Going to the file and place embedded options. From here, I downloaded icon and making this one smaller that's good and placing according to this guideline right press blending options and make this one color overlay and hit ok press ctrl or command t and making this one your logo or logo that's good i'll make the color white that's good and now make the font into full boom that's good Press Ctrl or Command T. You can make this one smaller like this and place over there. And I'll select these two things, making this one smaller. Selecting this, press Ctrl or Command T. Actually, this layer and this icon layer, this and this. Press Shift and hold it, making this one smaller. And now I'll write down something over there, like a uh, textile or dress collection. 
D R E W S T R E N T S prints. Okay, this one is our title and placing over there. Press order option button and make this one another copy of this layer. And I'll make this one into like medium type font and then I'll make the font size 1 by 6 that means divided by 1.6 times smaller boom and paragraph that should be aligned with this that's good and then press T for the text tool and the text should be like that okay text size I'll make this one like 9 pt that's good and make this one regular font and medium to regular that's good okay and put this one alignment like that that's fine and now I'll make button which is the shop now button okay making this one a little bit of brown and color should be white if on that text tool for the text tool and write down and now making this one into the bold font that's fine okay press cover command T making this one a little bit more bigger and placing it upper side and middle I'll pick the color from here that's good and placing it to the middle of this now social media icon like that so going to the illustrator tool and we have some icon over there this one copy this one and going to the photoshop and our design and control command v and hit ok control command d making this one is smaller and shop now and this one should be this one is order option button to copy this just copy a little bit that's good color command team you can make this one rotation in the downside that means the upper side of these will use this photo going to the place embedded options and this photo should be bigger and after that we'll make this one opacity down 20 percent that's good but one thing is that we'll go to the filter and camera filter we'll desaturate this one that means vibrance and saturation and okay so it will help you out to make mention and the fill color should be or down okay that's fine and now we'll write down this one a cursive letter trace so copying this one cut her command t and paste over there okay let's control command t making this one bigger and placing over there dress and press t that means the text tool and write down collection we'll change the font into our poppins regular font it could be the bold one and the white color is good and press control command t making this one smaller our design is ready so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of questions please do comment on my video comment section until the next video is everyone signing up today Stay safe, stay healthy and bye-bye.